All right, here we go. Question number 13 in our college algebra homework number six in my lab math. And it says, find the logarithm. And don't say, well, there it is. That's not what they mean by find the logarithm. They mean evaluate. They want us to work this out and give the answer. And so I've got the problem written down up here in my little screen. Let's look at how to work this out manually. And then we'll look at how to get the answer electronically. Okay, so the first thing I notice is that this value, this 625, that is a power of 5. Okay, so we need to figure out how many times, in other words, 5 to what power is 625, okay? Well, 5 squared, 5 to the second is 25, 5 to the third is 125, 5 to the fourth is 625. So I'm going to be able to rewrite this expression as log base 5 of 1 over... 5 to the 4th. And I think it is important that you know how to say this. This is log base 5 of this fraction. The next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to get rid of this fraction. And it turns out if I take 5 to the 4th and simply bring it up to the top so that there's nothing in the bottom, that'll get rid of the fraction but you have to understand that bringing something up from the denominator like this 5 to the 4th, that's going to change the sign of his power. So that's going to make that 5 to the negative 4. And now look at what I'm taking the log of. This is now log base 5 of 5 to the negative 4. And now I can see that these bases match. And when the bases match, they cancel. And so the answer here is going to be just negative 4. At least that's what I think it is. Let's check it electronically. So with our handy-dandy Casio class whiz, I'm going to point you out this button right here. This button will do log. You can put the base in and then whatever you've got. And we're going to actually put in the original problem. Okay, so this is log base 5. We're going to move over. And using the fraction button, we can say 1 over 625. Bam! And it verifies our handwritten work. There you go. So I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put them in the comment section below. Or you can text me. And thanks for watching.